Hello and welcome. It's good to have you here again. I am Olu Wakemi and this is WASI Exam 2018 Economics Objective Test Question. 2. Which of the following is not emphasized in a production possibility curve? Let us take a look at the production possibility curve. Okay, and we're going to look at some assumptions that uh, underlaying this production possibility analysis okay so it is of an assumption that the resources are of two goods okay for instance we have goods A and B as shown in this diagram okay good then secondly the quantities of the resources are fixed they don't change it is quantity A, goods A and goods B, the quantities doesn't change, okay? Good. Then the third assumption is that the technology and production techniques do not change as well. Why the fourth assumption is that resources that are used are used in a technical efficient way. All right. So with this, let us go to the question and the answer options. Which of the following is not emphasized in a production possibility curve? PPC. The option A says scarcity of resources. Another thing that we need to understand about the production possibility analysis is that whenever there is scarcity of resources, this is indicated somewhere within the production possibility curve. Okay, so scarcity of resources is indicated within the production possibility curve because the resources are limited. The resources that are available cannot meet up with the PPC. All right, the second option, economic development. Economic development, don't mistake it for economic growth. For economic development, has to deal with the social and political welfare of the people in the country. Although it implies economic growth, but it is not shown in the PPC curve. Economic growth itself is shown in the PPC because it deals with the increase in the level of the output. Okay, good. So economic development is not shown in the PPC. What about option C? Inefficiency in the use of resources. Whenever there is inefficiency in the use of resources, likewise there is scarcity of resources, it is going to be signified right within the production possibility curve. Okay, so this is indicated in the PPC curve. All right. Lastly, is the unemployment of labor. Unemployment of labor also shows that there is inefficiency. There is not enough usage of the available labor. So this also is signified somewhere within the production possibility curve. So this is emphasized in the PPC curve. Option B is the right answer because economic development is not emphasized in the PPC. Okay, good. Thank you for watching. See you in the next video. Bye-bye.